guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to use Agoda app. So if you're interested, let's start tutorial. Now, how do you use the Agoda app here? Well, the first thing we need to do here is we need to open up Agoda here and log in into our account. Once logged in, what we need to do is we need to go to the homepage here and we now need to ser uh, choose the service that we want to avail. So there's going to be a few ones here like hotels, flights, and combination, which is flights and hotel, activities, and home apps. We also have the car rentals at the bottom here, airport transfer, trains, buses, and ferries. So as an example, we'll be using the hotel service here. Let's go ahead and click on it. Now we need to specify a few things here and there are a few customizations that you can do here. Now, if you want to change currency they want to use or see here, you could go and click on the currency at the top right and choose your currency here. We also have the option to change this to British Pound or the up price preview here if you want to include the total stay here or the average per night option. So in this case, I'll be keeping the default options here. But again, if you want to customize it, you could go and do that. Now, we now need to specify a few things here. So for example, we need to specify the location where we want to go. So for example, I'm going to go to Brisbane. Let's go and choose this one. Now we now need to choose the date. So for example, we are going to be traveling starting on the 11th to 13th. Let's go and choose that date. Let's click on the OK two nights here. Let's go ahead and choose that. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to choose how many people are going to be staying in that specific room. So you, you could specify how many rooms, how many adults, or how many children are included in here. Let's go ahead and choose two or uh, one adult here and one room. Click on OK. Now from here, let's go ahead and click on search. Now this will search for hotels or apartments that are in that specific area. Now you should be able to see different apartments here. So in this case, maybe I want to get the second one here, which is going to be the Cliff House Motel. Let's go ahead and choose this one. And from here, what we need to do is we just need to read all the provided amenities, the highlights here. And uh, if you want to avail the rooms that I have here, also if you want to view the location and some of the nearest um, uh, locations like parks or uh, galleries within that area it sh show you in here like 1.99 kilometer uh, kilometers for a gallery and modern art here so have a uh, helpful facts regarding this uh, uh room or this service so for example there are going to be hotel policies as well here and extra beds so in this case they will provide you information for that but again if you want to proceed with this one just click on see all rooms here and from here you could go and choose the room that you want to get so again, depending on the options that you see here, so you can see we have the one adult, uh, which is non-refundable. This one is 327 and the express check-in free Wi-Fi. So for example, we want to get this one, but you could also specify how many rooms that uh, they actually have here. So currently this is the last room for this one, but if you choose the other options here, you should be able to choose how many rooms that you should be able to get. In this case, you go and click on book here or add to cart if you want to book or get another room as well. Once you click on the book option here, what we need to do is we just need to basically finalize this one. Like for example, providing your details, some questions here that they, that they need to be answered and the confirmation of the, uh, stop, the details here. In this case, just click on next file step here, which is going to be the payment method that you will have to complete. In this case, provide your payment method and you should be able to book this room and that's how you use I go to app and that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.